back again. This time heading up to Rye for uh, four or five days and uh, with, with the family. I'm, trying to, I'm gonna try and get out of uh, Port Phillip Bay and hopefully get uh, some fish. The last few episodes, no fish. Uh, yeah, um, this journey, good or bad, we're gonna post it up anyway, so um, yeah, we're not just gonna post awesome, uh, awesome stuff all the time. We're, we're gonna post, you know, if we have bad days, we're gonna post it. If we have good days, we're gonna post it. So yeah, see what happens. See you in Alrighty, I'm out. Man, that boat ramp is hectic. I've just got out here at first light at Rye. And uh, yeah, a mad rush. So I'm gonna, uh, gonna head out, channel somewhere, drop the pick and um, sit out there for four or five hours and try and catch a fish. See us out there. Temp is uh, 20 degrees. It's actually really nice. Got four baits out. Three. Fourth one going out. That's all I'm doing. Usual uh, Western Port rig. Now uh, we sit back and wait. Usual, pillies, coffee, rods. Got a padnosta here, and just uh, three Western ports out there. Obviously, can only have four because uh, I'm out on my own. So, if you're out on your own, it's four rods only. All right, sit and wait. It's uh, about seven o'clock in the morning. Gonna uh, probably give it here four hours. Four or five hours and then uh, pack it in, go back to the wife and kids and spend the afternoon with them. This is actually the first time in a couple of months um, since pretty much snapper season started in sort of uh, you know September, October. We're in uh, mid to late January now. This is the first time we've been out at Port Phillip Bay. I've had a couple of goes at Western Port with some snapper, two goes actually, and uh, nothing as you guys saw. So um, yeah, hopefully over the next uh, yeah few days I'm up at Rye, might be able to uh, put something on the deck for you. Fingers crossed. You anchor up somewhere and then uh, you get a bunch of boats come up near but what they don't realize is I don't know what I'm doing and I haven't caught a fish I haven't got a snapper in months so uh, hopefully they bring the fish I'm sure what this is but just a bit doesn't feel great Feels like a banjo. Yeah, definitely fighting like a banjo. No fight at all. It's getting really rough out here. I um, don't think I'm going to actually stay here much longer. Here it is. Look at that. Call it straight away. Just a little guy. That's it. That's the first one for today. Just letting go. I was just checking this bait and something's on the end of that too. Probably another banjo. 
I can't even pick this one up off the ground. This has to be a massive stingray. So I can't even lift him. Well, that's it for day one. I feel sick. I'm going to throw up. It's just too rough out there. It was meant to get better, but it's not. So, packing it in. See you on day two. Day two. Tell her Nate, you ready? Well, again, the weather was meant to be actually nice and calm. We're going to go take the kids uh, do a bit of squid fishing, but um, the weather's just really bad again. Uh, it should it should calm down a little bit in the next hour or two, but it should be uh, should have been better than this. But that's the weather for you, I guess. Anyway, it's true. We need to go anywhere. We just need to ripe here, and we're going to um, try and get some squid here. But see if the wind uh, dies down a little bit. Tyler's turn. Any squid? Not yet. I've waited about two hours now. Just had some uh, brekkie with the wife and kids. Um, weather saying it should calm down. I've just been helping people uh, get on and off the ramp here. It's uh, still windy, so um, I'm probably going to give it another half an hour. If it doesn't die down, then that's it. That's it for me. I'm not going to head back out. So. what it is we're up baby all right look at this I uh, it was still a bit rough at Rye but I managed to uh, I said it was all right you know down Frankston Mount Martha way so I managed to uh, get out the weather got better out here so I'm just uh, I'm just out uh, somewhere on the channel hopefully sit here for a few hours the weather stays like this and um, we'll look Something comes along, one snapper. I've been waiting in the car park for like two hours, three hours for the weather to change so I can get out. One snapper, come on. If not, I'm glad I got out here anyway. Anyway, bait, ready to go. Well, fairly. All right, now we wait again. Oh, not sure what this is. It's just, uh, this rod just took off. Um, all right, let's find out. It's acting really big and docile. It's only been out. Just like I just picked it up and just kept going. It's just big and slow. It's just cruising. So, probably a stingray. There's no shakes or anything. Oh, man. So it's destroyed me and my other lines as well. Damn you. All right. Oh, yep, stingray. And now I'm getting bitten by a little tiny fish that's taken the bait. So nothing yet. It's been about an hour. Um, at the end of the day, uh, you know, we post videos like this. Like I said, we can't always show catching fish all the time. Um, it's all about the journey, um, you know, the bad the bad days you're gonna you're gonna see it with us and the good days you're gonna see it with us so it just makes every episode more interesting i think rather than us just put out catching fish all the time who knows we still may catch a fish we still may not look at these flatties man look at him took it all took the whole thing couple of dolphins All right, I think that's about it. Uh, yeah, again, no fish. Like I said, this channel is all about just going through the uh, motions. Um, some days we're gonna be good, some days we're gonna be bad, but we're gonna post it all because it's all about putting in the hard yards and uh, 
basically coming along for the journey. So you just never know, you know, from episode to episode, whether we're gonna catch anything or whether, you know, we're gonna bag out. So uh, again, thanks to everyone for watching, staying tuned as always, and uh, yeah. We will be doing other fishing, as in hopefully, uh, you know, some tuna kingfish and some deep water stuff uh, later on in the year. But um, as always, see you on the next one. All right, just want to say a shout out to all those that have uh, subscribed over the last 12 months. And uh, if you haven't, I hope you're enjoying the content and uh, hopefully one day, Subscriber too.